Yay! Our trip is booked. I am giving a TED talk in April. Yeah, today I have to present it in front of a bunch of coaches. They get some feedback. Now we're heading to the green room. I'm gonna get my makeup touched up and then we're gonna be on soon. Hey guys, it is Monday and we're already on like the third vlog ever on this channel, which is crazy. The weeks keep flying by. We are headed to- Estimated time in traffic, 12 minutes. <laughs> Continue straight for 15 minutes. Always in traffic. Road. Road. We are actually heading to Centennial College um, and we're going for a very, very, very special reason. I am giving a TED talk in April, which is crazy saying that out loud. Don't really know why they've asked me to do a TED talk, but here we are. So all weekend I was writing a rough draft of the talk and yeah, today I have to present it in front of a bunch of coaches. They get some feedback. Carla's coming to film some of it, well, all of it. Um, one, so I can watch it back and like see what I sound like, and also so I can show you guys a little sneak peek. On Wednesday, I am going on global television. Uh, it's like the global morning show here in, <laughs> which, <laughs> no big deal. <laughs> Tomorrow, I think I'm gonna take the day off because um, literally I have been just non-stop working and writing this TED talk. Guys, this TED talk is 18 minutes long and I wrote the whole thing this weekend, very last minute. But I work way better under pressure when it comes to writing. You excited to hear my talk? You know what I'm excited about? What? This jar. <laughs> so I got these from Indigo on sale. They were $5. I just think it's like the cutest little smoothie bottle. I'm very excited about it. Right? Maybe I'll give you one. Maybe you'll just leave it in my car. Yeah, I'll just take it. Yeah, I have a habit of leaving like cups and straws and I'm starting a collection <laughs> and I'm gonna be selling them. Literally, I went over to Carla's house the other day and I was like, this is a cute cup. She's like, it's yours. <laughs> Cause I leave them in her car. Um, okay, so next time we see you, we'll be at Centennial. I don't feel nervous. Should I be nervous? No. Okay. No. Do you think you're gonna cry? Here we go. Whenever you're ready. You guys, that went so well. Um, the feedback I got from the coaches was amazing. Um, I also wanted to say if you guys want us to come see the TED Talk if you're in Toronto, um, go follow me on Instagram because I will be linking the link to the tickets. If you can't make it, then you can watch it live. They're, um, they're broadcasting it live. So if I like mess up on stage or if I like puke or like black out or something, um, be... you guys can all watch it happen live. That would be hilarious. Would you laugh? No. You would. Good morning you guys it is Wednesday and it is bright and early um, and I'm just getting up to get ready for my TV segment today on global news it's uh, live so that's always a little bit nerve-wracking um, today I'm talking about uh, laundry hacks so <clears throat> decor hacks for your laundry room um, yeah, and I wanted to take you guys along because it's always a fun, fun process. And I'll also, I want to do a little like get ready with me so you guys can see how I do my makeup and stuff for a TV segment. Okay, let's go. I'm dressed, washed my hair, no makeup on. Um, I'm going to take you through my routine. So I have toner on, I have, um, moisturizer and I have face oil. So now I'm gonna do my hair. I have been loving the Kristen S air dry cream. I can't say enough good things about this. I'll link it down below. Literally, I put it in my hair. 
um, I let my hair air dry or I just dry it with a hair dryer and like all my natural waves come out it's shiny it's manageable to just wear like without styling it I am gonna style it today but yeah I really 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 have enjoyed this and I'm thinking in the summer it'll be great because I never dry my hair in the summer I just let it dry natural and like wavy so I think that this is gonna be great Okay, so when my hair is about 90% dry, I just twist it up um, in a clip. I put the clip in and then I do my makeup. So first thing I do is go in with Instant Age Rewind Eraser. Is it Maybelline? Yeah, it's Maybelline. I just go under my eyes with this. And I just rub it in with my fingers. And then I go in with just like a regular concealer and I put that all over my red spots. Honestly, you guys, I have never really worn lots of makeup, like ever. Um, usually, Alana, who you guys have met in vlogs before, does my makeup. Um, I wear like pretty minimal and simple, simple makeup. I just feel better that way. And then I brush out my eyebrows and I fill them in wherever they need to be filled in. And then I go in with my blush. I will never ever use another blush. Um, I use the Cloud Paint by Glossier. It's just like natural. You get lots of color. It's just, it's just so great. I'm using the color Puff. And then I go in with my um, highlight stick, also by Glossier. And again, just use my finger, this one. And then I use a liquid eyeliner. This one's the classic felt tip liner um, from Ulta Beauty, but I use the brown one um, just to make it a little more like subtle and not so like, whoa, in your face. Lash curler. I've used the same mascara for years. Whenever I try and switch it up, I just don't like it as much as this one. It's the Maybelline Colossal. I take my hair down, which I've left up in that clip. It has a little bit of a curl to it. I might go in and dry it just a bit more. Um, and then I'm going to give it a little curl. I get questions about this so much. It's my favorite lipstick ever. It's called D for Danger by MAC. I wear it all the time. I used to go into TV segments and know what I was gonna say line for line, word for word. And actually, um, a news anchor told me, he was on the show with me and he was like, you know, just try and not rehearse. He's like, know what you're gonna say, obviously, um, and know your tips, but try and not rehearse it to make it sound more natural. And ever since he said that, I've like, not really, I, well, I know, I haven't even written out what I'm gonna say. I just know what tips I'm gonna say, know my like intro to get into the segment, and then I just kind of wing it. Um, so if in this time lapse you see me talking to myself, it's because, it's because I'm rehearsing. <laughs> I am wearing this dress from Mod Cloth. It's very patterned. And then this necklace I just got from this local store near my house called Juxtapose. Elena's gonna be here soon. Um, she's probably waiting for me downstairs. And then we're gonna head out. Guys, we're here. Backstage, Elena's with me, and we're gonna get setting up. Today I'm talking about laundry room hacks. So Alana and I usually prep, well we prep everything beforehand, we style everything so that when we get here we can just set it up. Because it's live, that means that um, there's not a lot of time to set up and you have to have everything ready by 9 a.m. So it's like a bit of a time crunch, but we can do it. Like I mentioned, we style it when we're at home and then we take a picture of it. So we remember um, where we placed everything and then it's just really easy to grab everything and style it when we're here. That was stressful as always. Not stressful, but like 
just a mad dash. Now we're heading to the green room. I'm gonna get my makeup touched up and then we're gonna be on soon. I'm just heading into the studio because I'm on, because I'm on Zoom. Um, yeah, okay, let's do this. Guys, there's some um, very well-known people on the show today. Alana and I were in the group and we're like, okay, hey. It's so exciting. I'm also getting really nervous. I always get so nervous before I go on. 30. Here we go. Okay, segment is done. It always just feels like it flies by. Was it good? It was good. <laughs> I'm home. Even though the segment is like five minutes door to door, it's like you have to get up, you have to get ready, and you have to get your makeup done, and then you have to go on. I'm starving, so Elena and I are going to get some sushi, and then we're going to work for the rest of the day. Yay! Our trip is booked! So we just booked um, a flight to LA because I'm doing the first overseas makeover ever. Any guesses in the, uh, in the comments, let me know. I'm making over someone's um, space, and this person is very exciting. So Carla, Alana, and I are going for four days in May. Um, yeah, the first makeover out of the country. So exciting. And hopefully I'm making over someone else's space while I'm there. So two people's spaces. Also, I said to Alana, I'm so excited because um, it's the first time that I can use Target in a makeover. Like Alana and I have a day booked to go to Target together to source items for the makeover. She's like, wait, but we're never apart. <laughs> What am I gonna do? Oh, yeah, no, Lottie. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, um, I am the worst vlogger and forgot to end this vlog. So I'm just popping in here to say thank you guys so much for watching and also to plug a really fun new newsletter I have. I had a newsletter for a while um, that maybe some of you watching were subscribed to. I just hadn't updated it in a while. I hadn't been putting out um, a weekly newsletter as per usual because I just wasn't really happy with the format. But I have finally come up with an idea that I'm really excited about. And basically the newsletter is turning into something called the decor edit. So every Wednesday in the morning, you will get a newsletter that starts with a trend that I'm really loving so this week it's like arches and then you'll get shoppable like weekly decor picks right to your inbox you can just click you can go to the link you can buy them so this way you guys can just sit back in your bed shop from your phone and I'm including decor picks and I'm also including some style picks as well so here's the sneak peek of the newsletter if you want to sign up go to the link down below. It'll direct you to my website. It's in the description box. And then on my website, there's a little box and then you can sign up for the decor edit. Thank you guys so much for watching this weekly vlog. It was like a, fun, it was a fun jam packed week and I hope you enjoyed seeing a bit of behind the scenes and I will see you on Saturday for a brand new video. It's a good one. It might be a pet hack. Okay. See you next time.